Hello Internet, welcome to another video on electromagnetic field and theory. Today's topic of discussion is skin depth or in other words we call it depth of penetration. According to the definition it is the depth in which the wave has been attenuated to 1 by E or approximately 37% of its original value. Now what is the physical interpretation of this? Whenever the wave uh, travels from one medium into some other medium which is solid, for example a conductor or a dielectric, then how much how much deep it can penetrate without losing its energy is what skin depth is all about. Now, to understand the concept of skin depth, we must know the values of alpha and beta for different media. Alpha is attenuation con constant. and beta is known as the phase constant. Both alpha and beta are directly proportional to sigma which is the conductivity of the medium. If the conductivity of the medium is high, the wave is likely to get attenuated easily. Or in other words, if we subject an electromagnetic wave into the surface of a conductor, it will attenuate pretty quickly. And that is the reason why uh, we say that uh, conductors do not have charge inside them and the charge resides on the surface of the conductor and at low frequencies uh, the skin depth is large and at high frequencies skin depth is small this is the second point uh, that I'd like to discuss the first point being the direct proportionality of alpha and beta to conductivity. <clears throat> now coming to the formula for skin depth, skin depth is denoted by delta and it is equivalent to 1 upon alpha. The more the attenuation the lesser it can penetrate. It's as simple as that. The lesser the attenuation, the more it can penetrate into the medium. And alpha itself is equivalent to uh, this thing in the denominator. And you can see the proportionality of alpha is um, it is directly proportional to both sigma and omega. So that is why we say when attenuation is more due to conductivity, the skin depth reduces and at high frequencies also the skin depth reduces. So for uh, good conductors we know the formula for alpha if if you if you really wish to know the derivation and formula for alpha and beta for different media like conductor dielectric and free space uh, you should check out my previous video on uh, phase constant and attenuation constant along with the propagation constant it will help you a lot but for the time being we we have taken this formula directly from that discussion 
and the reciprocal of alpha becomes the skin depth for good conductors. So now I will like to take up one numerical where it is being asked to find the skin depth and wave velocity at 2 megahertz in aluminium with conductivity conductivity is given and mu r is given so I'll say sigma is 40 mu r is 1 and the frequency is 2 into 10 raised to the power 6 hertz now if we if we consider aluminium to be a good conductor so we can directly apply the formula for propagation constant for good conductors the propagation constant for good conductor is given by omega mu sigma and this is also taken from a previous discussion and we simply need to substitute the values here because everything is known here four pi into ten is to power minus seven is the value of mu naught and then So what we are left with is, uh, after calculation we get this value, and converting this into a rectangular format will give me the value of alpha and beta because gamma is equal to alpha plus j beta and when we convert this polar form into rectangular you can do it in on the calculator 991ES and I've made a comprehensive video on how to convert polar into rectangular and rectangular into polar using calculator. So my alpha comes out to be equivalent to 1.2 this and beta comes out to be equivalent to this. <laughs> and we simply need alpha for the calculation of delta so that will be 1 upon alpha which becomes 56.27 micrometer and wave velocity is given by omega upon beta omega is 2 pi f upon beta so substituting the values here we get the value as 707 point one two meters per second so that is how you can calculate skin depth from attenuation constant a little bit of theory uh, and its applications are immense and practical application is the uh, limitation of conductors to store charge within themselves so I hope this quick tutorial on skin depth and depth of penetration was helpful and if you liked the video click on the like button and subscribe to the channel I'll see you in the next one goodbye